Hello, everyone. Today we are talking about CA Technologies Release Automations integration with SkyTap. SkyTap offers cloud-based solutions for managing and delivering just-in-time software development and test environments. The CA Release Automation SkyTap Action Pack lets you seamlessly interact with SkyTap to improve throughput of the software delivery lifecycle. Enabling testing early and often significantly accelerates time to market, reduces production issues, and lowers the total cost of software releases. The Release Automation SkyTap Action Pack enables users to create workflow processes to provision, configure, and tear down multiple cloud environments in SkyTap directly within a deployment workflow. The SkyTap actions include operations such as create and delete new environments, create projects, schedules, and templates. You can also get environment run states, get and attach public IPs and published URLs, and get templates, template VMs, and SkyTap users. Our use case to speed up deployment time and increase efficiency is to build out our infrastructure in SkyTap, deploy our applications from our new build, and upon successful completion of our test cases, tear down our testing environment. Let's take a look at release automation. On the release automation dashboard, we can see the status of our release automation environment. We can see that we have two agents, two applications, one of which is SkyTap, which is the application we're going to be using for our use case. We also have several deployments that have already been run. The deployment Deploy Infra 08 ran the deployment plan, infrastructure and application deployment in the dev environment. Clicking on it, we can see the details of the deployment. The first step in the pre-deployment was provision environment. This process interfaced with SkyTap and built out the development environment needed. During the deployment phase, the application was deployed to the new environment. In the post-deployment phase, the test suite was run against the deployed application, and once it was successfully completed, the environment was decommissioned. Now let's run a new deployment by running the infrastructure and application deployment plan, which maps the deployment logic and the specific artifacts for a particular release. This plan can be promoted to other environments, guaranteeing that the same content is deployed to each environment for every release. Now let's take a look at SkyTap. We already have a template created in SkyTap for our development environment. Once the deployment is running, we see that a new environment is being provisioned. So let's take a look at what is happening behind the scenes. First, we get the authorization token using a SkyTap username and password. Then we actually create the environment from our template. Next, we have a loop that checks the status of the environment. We then get a list of available public IPs from SkyTap, get the environment VM information, select the IP, and attach it to our new VM. Once that is complete, we power on the server. Next, we will deploy our application and run the test suite. Upon successful completion of the test suite, we will deprovision the testing environment. We can now see that the environment has been deleted from SkyTap. We just saw how the CA Technologies Release Automation SkyTap integration can accelerate your DevOps journey. Thank you very much for watching. <laughs>